I'm working on Slaughter on 10th Avenue, as done by The Ventures. Doing it phrase by phrase. The phrase I'm up to sounds like this. So this is going to be a short uh, amount of notes. It's just a little turnaround, a little chord thing. So it's based on a, a B minor to a B flat sus2 or add 9, and then a D. Then a turnaround on a B flat to an A. So there's something going on there. So the B minor, we're going to go. That's just a little stair step guy here. That's a four, two. The chord is F sharp, D, B. Then we've got this little lick. It's gonna be ring finger, third string, third fret, and then index would lay flat on the first fret, on the first and second strings. And you get that little phrase. So it's B flat, C, D, C, B flat, then a D chord. Basically a D5. Then you got this turnaround of a B flat, which is laying flat at the third fret. Take it down to second fret. All right, so here's all the parts, all the little sections put together. The starts with the chords. Then the drums come in, and there's that little guitar riff, and finally the lead part. Now the new part. Then we'll have another uh, kind of verse riff coming up. So uh, let's just make sure you've got this new part. It's uh, If you put all those parts together, you'll have it. Uh, if you want to just look up the uh, the guy that I'm uh, copying here, uh, just uh, look up Slaughter on 10th Avenue on YouTube, and you'll find a tutorial where the guy has the tab running under the screen. He just plays the song at speed. So what I'm doing is just slowing it down and uh, doing some repetitions on each little section and it gets, uh, on the last two verses, gets a little hairy, so it will come in handy to have uh, somebody kind of break it down for you because the tab goes by pretty fast. But I'm sure you could slow it down. Anyway, any, any way you want to learn is good. So you just learn the way you, you want, but keep learning every day. It's worth it.